Uh, four minutes or less recipes. We're Alex and Felix. I'm Felix. Alex right here. Uh, today we're making red funnel cake. Red velvet funnel cake. Yeah, that's my favorite kind of funnel cake, actually. Yeah. Yeah. You know what? Whenever I go to uh, the carnival, I never get funnel cake. I'm not a fan. Yeah. Not my favorite thing. I always get... There's always so much to get. You, you can't... Yeah, you, you can't don't... Lose. Yeah. yeah, you get something special, right? Yeah. Anyway. Uh, so we're doing the eggs here. Take the eggs, whisk them up uh, just to beat them. Uh, put the milk in, put some sugar in, uh, a little bit of vinegar, uh, and some red food coloring. That's what makes it red, okay. uh, as well as some vanilla. Uh, back in the day, uh, it was something to do with how they processed cocoa powder, that when you added a, an acid to it, and in this case vinegar, um, it made it like a red color. Uh, it doesn't do that anymore because we're better at refining it, but yeah. uh, that's why it's, it's red velvet with that cocoa powder vinegar thing yeah. we just did. Yeah. Uh, it doesn't do that anymore. You gotta use the food coloring no, if you want red. No. You can leave it out, but then it, it's not red. Anyway, uh, we whisked up the dry ingredients there, which were just uh, flour, uh, cocoa powder, and I think it was baking soda. Do you have to add them in slowly, or can you just dump it all in? Uh, I added all the dry ingredients in one third at a time to the wet mixture. Okay, okay. Uh, here we're putting it in the piping bag. Uh, to do it easy, you can just get a big cup, put a bag in. I just use a regular yeah. you know, Ziploc bag put the batter in uh here we're frying it you can make any pattern you want here right any pattern you want oh, i just yeah. do the circle because it sticks together the best yeah. um the oil that's also is, that's what they do at carnivals too. yeah well at carnivals they have like a metal like disc they oh, yeah? put it in and they lift it up so that's what, why it's so uh oh. so shaped but anyway, it still turns out the same shape yeah well <laughs> ours is it's a little messier anyways that oil was 350 degrees uh put it in wait till it's a little crisp on the bottom uh flip it over with tongs wait a couple minutes i think total cooking time is it's only a couple minutes if that I mean, okay. keep an eye on it. Don't move away. Uh, <laughs> okay, yeah. got it. Uh, here we're doing the strawberry sauce. So uh, take your strawberry, cut the top off. We're going to cut that into quarters. Uh, put it in a pan or a pot. We're going to use uh, some lemon juice to balance out the sugar. And then we're going to put some sugar in. How many strawberries did you... Uh... Uh, good question. We'll put it in the description below. Okay, okay. Maybe, uh, maybe a cup and a half chopped up i mean we're not making a lot yeah okay you can scale yeah. it if, if you're making a lot right yeah yeah so here we're putting it over medium low heat okay uh we're just going to reduce and get all the moisture out of it uh yeah. here i added a little bit of water i thought i could use some so i think i used like an eighth of a cup oh so okay. i didn't okay. use very much why do you to, think you needed water um i didn't want it to burn i was a little concerned about it and i would rather have some more liquid because you want a very runny thing oh okay yeah, See, I so, didn't know that. yeah so anyways we cooked till the strawberries were mushy put it in a strainer to get all the juice out of it and there's that uh, next to make the whipped cream, you know, we've made this a bunch of times on the show. Take some cream, put it in your, uh, your food, pro not food processor, your, uh, your stand. whipping device, whipping device, <laughs> yeah. uh, whip it till soft peaks. Then we put the sugar in and then you continue whipping it until you get stiff peaks. I mean, we do this all the time with cream eggs. If you follow the show, I mean, we've done this, nothing new and original here. <laughs> But yeah, there's the, we got to show the stiff peaks. Yeah, apparently. yeah, it's not hard, people. Yeah. Anyways, we take the funnel cake we made, do some uh, some dusting of powdered sugar, which you need that sugar in it because the cake itself is not very sweet. So don't do the sugar. Don't think you're doing yourself a favor by not putting it. Do the sugar, otherwise you're not gonna. It's just it just doesn't yeah, really taste yeah. like it. It's just fried dough then at that point. Okay. Anyways, we take the uh, we take the cream we made, pipe that on. We yeah. take the strawberry sauce, and there you have it. I mean, it's it's a pretty simple thing. Yeah. The frying's a little tricky, but uh, I mean, other than that, it's not hard at all. No, it looks so good. The pictures look good. Anyways, yeah. we'll uh, we'll see you guys next week. Yeah. Thank you for watching, everyone.